Um, okay, Isaac, continue to use last week's videos. Oh, yeah, you can just toss them on the couch. Or you, can, you can shuffle all that stuff out of your way, whatever's in your way. Uh, they're not his gloves, though. Oh, sorry, they're not his gloves, that's right. Okay, Isaac, righteous. So what did we do today? We reviewed uh, your thirds. Okay. And then we reviewed them also. Did you leave something? Oh, cool. We reviewed them in the next um, string pairs with the down-up motion. You can repeat that in the key of D, key of G, and then especially the anomaly key of C. And then that pertains, or, or lends itself best to the open G. Now you can do the full octave scale. Minor, minor, major. Okay, then we reviewed your two octave active scales. Then I gave you your first task exercise. We took a D shape for baby driver, but we put it to E. And we did the arpeggio. So T stands for triad, A stands for arpeggio. S stands for scale, first finger on the E5. And the C stands for color, meaning what is the cool stuff in this position? Bend the second note, whole step, reverse, reverse half. Uh, ascend with the pinky. Bend the first string. Play your major thirds. That's some of the cool stuff to do with that shape. And then uh, continue to work on Baby Driver. Uh, I'll just play it once briefly as Bob's getting his guitar going. Tap. Last week's video. Have fun, dude.